Yeah, we're going to go back to one of the sheriff's races. Rex Hodge is following the sheriff's race in Jackson County. He joins us live in Silver, Rex. Good evening. This is Rex Hodge reporting live from the Jackson County Courthouse here in the Sheriff's Office. I'm following the Jackson County Sheriff's race this evening. And right now, with 86% of precincts reporting, Democrat Chip Hall is leading Republican Curtis Lambert 65 to 35%. So a commanding lead right there right now. But again, not all precincts are reporting just yet. I did talk to Chip Hall a little earlier this evening, and here's what he had to say to me about his chances, how he felt about how things are going today. Got good results today. Went around the community, all over Jackson County, talked to a lot of people. Uh, response has been real good, feel positive. Now, whoever is the new sheriff here, there will be a new sheriff in town, Jimmy Ash, stepping down after 12 years of heading up the Jackson County Sheriff's Department. Both candidates talking about if they become the new sheriff, there'll be a new complexion to the Jackson County Sheriff's Office, much more openness with residents and much more openness with the media. So we'll continue to cover this race for you as well. I also want to bring you up to speed on the state Senate race between Jane Hips and Jim Davis. Jim Davis, the Republican incumbent senator, Senator going for a third term, and right now, with 75% of precincts reporting, he is leading 53% over 47% belonging to Jane Hips. So, a fairly close race right there. Of course, more precincts yet to report. We'll continue to keep you updated as the results come in. For now, reporting live from Jackson County, Rex Hodge, News 13.